folks, welcome back to Ostriv. Just noticed that young Krillo here, 15 years old, is is on his way to go and help sow our impromptu sunflower field, our experiment. But let's, yeah, I decided, end of last episode, let's just throw this thing in here into this land that's not being used right now, and let's get a another round of sunflower into the economy. Yeah, it's just kind of an experiment, but I got a comment saying that when you see the trees bloom out that tells you that that's the year they're going to begin to harvest so we are near the end of may and this one was planted later i don't get the sense that we are two years since planted that this will be a harvestable cro well i guess from this angle it is this one's definitely not we're still i think we just got to the two years so we'll, 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 we'll see what happens there. Anyway, lots of comments came in regarding our, uh, our granary war over here. <laughs> um, one thought was that the peas didn't come in because this one was marked as take from other granaries. This one. And that it wasn't marked that the first time that she came to go get the, the uh, there it is. Yeah, so now you're going to go grab how many? 100. Okay, so now if I didn't have her marked for, are you the one doing it? You're the one doing it. If I didn't have you marked for taking one of the granaries, then you wouldn't have gone to get that. Uh, no required. Oh, 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 what's going on? You're here, are you just leaving or are you gonna hang? And you're gone. We didn't quite get the sunflower oil down here. Now we had asked to sell what? Oh, that's not here anymore. Okay, charcoal, 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 charcoal. There are only a thousand at a time. We said nine of them. I think we said, well, there's 300 sitting here. What, did you buy any? Did you just buy a partial? Can I get you to click? You got nothing. So you came and the total amount wasn't there and you walked away. You did grab a thousand charcoal. Okay. So I think I had set it for 400, thinking the other 100 would come down in time. That was a mistake. You are on your way to get something. I assume more charcoal. So we have charcoal in stock 4,000. We're calling for 10. And theoretically, these guys are as fast as they can going to get more charcoal. You are chasing down... Uh, doesn't say. Empty card is heading to... From the trading post. Yeah, it doesn't give me... Does it give me pathway? Show path? Ah, there we go. You are on your way to go and get more shoes. Okay, because I think shoes are also one that I jump the gun we'll see here you are here for something you're not going to say we're just waiting for one of these guys to come back to work there we go you're supplying a resource of shoes okay so jump in here fill this guy's cart please let's see what it is that they're here to get is it more charcoal no you're still unloading your shoes just give me a moment i'm busy i gotta go put this cart away <laughs> I think there's two wagons here. We're phasing in and out. Yeah, there's two sets of wheels there. We may have lost some of these trays by not having everything ready at the right at the moment. That's possible. Um, I have show path on. Oh, is that now going to work for everybody? Ah, it isn't just the one person. Okay, dude. Don't no 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 no. Don't go take a rest. Oh man. Okay, you are going to work. So you'll be here you know, in, a, in a week or so. You are taking a rest. You are supplying resources. And you're still on your way to get those more shoes. Okay. I really need people to be hauling charcoal down as fast as possible. Um, now, you guys just finished this. Sewing is done. I gave them the month off to be doing that kind of stuff. When are you guys going to trigger and fill in all of my laborers and haul a bunch of charcoal down 
So they probably finish the field. They're off to go home for some time to rethink their lives, and then they'll they'll be back in here to uh, to jump into various labor jobs, whether that is all the way down here, or if they're going to jump immediately into some of these jobs because they're closer. I don't know how the game prioritizes that. But I need you guys to all suddenly grab carts, come over here, and load up 6,000 of this and bring it on down before these guys give up. Now, the one who was coming to work, going to work, where are you at? Here you are. All right. I assume you're going to go straight to them, not go fill another resource. So let's speed you up a little bit and see what happens here. Got to go into the building, and now we're going to start filling up carts. Now, I guess I'm going to have to wait till they leave. Oh, you got... The honey. All right. You gotta go back in the building. Okay. You're gonna fill them up. Yep. And they're out of here with clothes. Okay. You brought more shoes. And you're unloading something. We bought salt from you. Okay. Cool. And you are here to pick up. Well, there's a lot of activity all at once. Back in there. Help them out. Charcoal's leaving. Okay. And you unloaded a whole bunch of stuff. What did you unload? I guess that was just a gob of shoes. So shoes, we've hit our our max here now. What's left in the town? Shoes, 100. So 100 left beyond the 500 here. Okay. Um, clothes left in town, 10. So we're kind of stealing the town blind by loading up the trader at the moment. But... We are not down at 250 anymore either, so that's that's all helped. You are supplying resources. No. What you doing over here? You are market stall, and you're trying to grab salt, I'll bet. Yeah. Salt for the market stall. Okay. The salt shipment arrived. Everyone grab it and go. <laughs> Alright, more carts are on their way in. We really need a bunch of... The cart is empty. Come on, guys. I need charcoal. I really need charcoal. Give me some laborers. There's one. And you are supplying resources. What does that mean? You are coming down to here. Oh, you're carrying some flour. Because we had called for flour. Okay. But I have a feeling we're going to turn away quite a few... Oh, there's a thousand coming in from somewhere. Okay, good. There it is. So you... I don't know who you are. You're just one of our normal workers. Ah, right there. Okay. So laborers never really did help. Interesting. Hmm. Dropping off the cart. Going back to the office, checking out more orders. Ah, I'm going to load this cart up on your way with charcoal. All right, that money's just rolling in. Okay, well, the majority of those trades worked. We'll just let that go at that. There's more carts on their way in and more guys showing up and grabbing carts and doing their things. So, what is happening here? You are bringing... You're at home right now, yeah. So, if we were to... Let me try and get back to that sentence that I almost got finished before all that happened. I'm slow down so that something else doesn't jump in and take over. Um... The issue had to do with take from other granaries. As soon as we selected this the last time, suddenly they stopped interacting with this granary. But if there is a whole bunch stocking up down here, I'd kind of like for them to be able to take it back. So I still don't really have a good solution there. Um, one possibility is to drop the quantities down. So peas there's two oh this is down below there so if i shift you to well peas where there's 1200 available it peas are apparently very abundant in town if i shift you to 500 you're only going to go to that point and quit leaving 500 or so in here too so if i take you to 500 then that's one way to kind of balance them out we have 250 that we don't need over here okay now if i I'm curious, if I say, if I don't say take from other granaries, but there's an excess over there, will that still trigger her to go find some to fill up her own granary in a place that's not calling for it? 
Okay, next experiment. So both of these have take from other granaries turned off. In fact, let's just... I can't... I can't tell all of them to do that. I have to do it manually. Let's just for now do that. Out of curiosity. Okay, all that is turned off. I'm going to experiment for a while here. Meanwhile, this is all done. We're still in May. And we are filling up these... No. What are all the other guys doing right now? Uh, where am I? Here. No. And here. Nobody's listed. Unless it's just a temporary. Just for the time that they're actually carrying the firewood. They're listed, then it goes away. These guys are not employed at the moment. They will again next month. Well, I didn't actually set it as a... As a as a, uh, what do you call that? Seasonal hiring thing. I just shut them off, but I'll turn them back on next month. But I'm curious where they are right now. <laughs> I'd like to know. Um, well, Workshop has run out of supplies, so I've they're no longer a thing. Still waiting for more ladies. Um, you are making textiles. You are grabbing the textiles and processing. You are storing. So guys labor. If you're not there, you're in here. And by the way, I think I need to max that out and just leave it there all year round. I, that's right. I, you guys have probably noticed my wall of shame up here that I didn't bring up yet. I went through and laid out a bit of a neighborhood in here. We need the, the workers here. And these workers don't seem to be able to take a job over here. So until we get enough of a balance going on down here to where these guys can... Or enough people to handle all the jobs down here, leaving all of these jobs for these folks, it's going to be a while before we can pull that off. I thought it might be a good idea to get a few more houses going in here. So what I did was I grabbed the, the ones that have five or less trees and moved them up to the front. The rest of them, eventually the trees will come down. So that will give us... One, two, three, four, I think five houses there. And then we'll get these three over here going. So I give us six families here and another four or five families over here. And that'll be the shot in the arm that we need. But this came, it took quite a while to, to make it look the way I wanted to. That's why I didn't want to do it on camera. I spent an awful lot of time muttering to myself. <laughs> but a road that comes in, I'm, I'm using this because it highlights them from our our center over here so it'll eventually roll in just like so and it's not too far away to we have to go all the way out to here to say no market stalls nearby so we can get a lot of housing in here if we choose to it's a lot of work though um but a road that goes like so potential of another road that will travel out here if i want to pop a few more houses up above and travel right on in and into their jobs over here but that's enough for the moment. And yeah, that was tricky. A lot of odd shapes in there to make that work. Um, I need to put a well at the end. And yeah. Okay, so that's what's going on over there. What was I in the middle of saying when I brought that up? I don't know, but I better turn this back on again while I'm, or I will talk the whole episode and forget to run the game. <laughs> I never do that. <laughs> um, I did wander through while I was doing all that and plop some more benches down and quite a few places. I set some trees and other decorations and slowly, but, oh, there's the bench. You can hardly see the benches. Um, and there's a birdhouse in there too and you can't really see it. Boy, that blends in well. Yeah, it's, it's in the shadows. Um, some more trees around here and there. Went down the the avenue here and dropped a, a nice birch tree right here in this intersection that's gonna look good a couple of trees in the corners of the the uh, graveyard where are you right there and well, a few places here and there we should have a tree shading our well over here so we should, probably should get a couple of them over here um what else we're running I pause it again I pause it again how are we on chickens? We've got 15 and 15, just like I've said. So let's... Uh-oh. 
we finally had our first death of old age. Rodovan, 87. So he will be... It already is? How does this work? Is it an instantaneous thing? Uh, this one... Right there? So it changes when they're used. I think they were all wooden ones before. Okay. 1639 to 1726. How many times did you get fired? <laughs> I'm afraid to look at this. Arrived in May of 1725. Started work at the fishing docks. Stopped working due to personal preference. Started working at the forestry. Stopped working. Fired. Started working at the fishing dock. Stopped working due to... I think that means it hit the, the winter freeze. And so they went home. Although it says started working at the forestry and then stopped working personal preference. And moved over to the boatyard. Got fired from the boatyard. Went to work at the fishing dock and stayed there until you became a constructor. And stayed there until the season ended. Then started at the construction office and, and got fired. And then started working at the trading post and died. <laughs> wow. It's quite a history. And I only fired him three times. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, that was that was exciting to see. Um, what was I talking about? Chickens. Let's go ahead and do this now. We've had a chance to, to see the chickens in the markets and in people's homes and they've probably all been eaten by now yeah how's our poor family so you're sitting at 16 last time i realized that i had meant to move it to 75 cents and then moved it back down to 50 to go to talk about something and never brought it back so in between episodes i moved it back to 75 so we've tried two dollars we tried 50 cents we tried one dollar so, horrible taxes, and then he started gaining a lot of personal wealth, and then one dollar started losing that personal wealth at a faster rate than I expected. So we're going to try the 75, which is right in the middle. There is a lot of wealth out there, in that many households have close to 80, and they're not getting taxed until that point. Um, we're basically taking everything after 80 by doing this. We could take that number down lower and take more of their wealth and use it in the town. But until I get all of this figured out just right, and that's unfortunately going to change as we go, as more jobs come available, better jobs come available, taverns come in, surgeries come in, which adds more money to the economy so we don't have to take as much from the homes. So there'll be a lot of adjusting this over, the, over time. But if we are constantly dropping... Six, it was 681, now 679, 680. So every few seconds, the game updates 681, 679. So we're kind of holding at, a, at an even right now without doing any major buying. And in, in uh, October, they'll buy from the town. So that would be artificially start dropping drastically. But, you know, the, the the crops from their yards. But as long as, when we figure out that we can maintain this, then we've, we're, I'm pretty comfortable that we're doing okay right in here. And after that, we could or could not tap the wealth of the citizens. But if I tap it all now and have not fixed the other, and then it continues to decline, i got nothing left to tap later. So I'd rather have this guy and eventually this guy be the main burden of bringing funds back into the system um we just got who are you Dirkachi? um actually i want that one Dirkachi is going to w want to buy our charcoal actually not much and Dirkachi is the the sale that i just messed up by not having what was it in stock sunflower oil Okay, so they've come back, and they want, they say, hey, give us more, give us more, we love it, give us more. So, okay, but I don't want to bankrupt the town. In fact, we still have people coming in for more charcoal. 
So have we, we got 29.49 here. I've got to make sure the charcoal is still coming in as fast as possible. That's interesting. It no longer has a... Did you guys rehire? No. Why does it no longer have a face right here for worker by hand and cart? What just happened there? We are into June. You probably hired. Well, your space opened up for you guys, but no one's available. Okay. But why did that go away? We are asking for 29.49 and it's but all this is satisfied. That's why it went away. Okay. Mm hmm. So how many guys are looking for jobs and are they working? I've got too many things running through my mind right now. Nobody is doing any of the charcoal. So it's like there's nobody looking for jobs. But I've got four or six guys that I've fired. So there should be somebody roaming around saying, Hey, you got a job for me? Um, unemployment, 7%. I wish that was a real number. It hurts too much to do the the math 7% of 25 yeah um I've just noticed the green bar too so that is our poorest amount I'm guessing that means 5 to 20 and then 20 to 40 so between 5 and 20 of personal wealth at home 17 so they fit in there but you are still going up so at 75 cents per month per certain amount of square footage of, of land they are able to get ahead now and they will get a lot more ahead when October gets here and they sell off their some kind of a vine cucumbers might be oh that's right cucumbers I got a comment just a little bit ago before I started recording to not buy raspberries because they use the raspberries to make dried fruit. And the dried fruit are more valuable to us. So if I say no raspberries, should I also say no apples? Would they not make dried fruit out of apples? Um, that's all that I'm seeing. We don't have these guys. These trees that I laid out. Where? That's here. Any sense of these bearing fruit yet? I think I put these in after the orchard, so probably not. Okay, so not buying, I'm going to guess it, that what was meant was fruit rather than just raspberry, but maybe I'm wrong there. Don't have a choice here anyway. Okay, anything new popping in though? No. All right, so yeah, so many rabbit trails. Where am I? I'm trying to figure out what to do with this trader um, that's coming in and trying to figure out what happened to everything. So where are my guys? If I rehire you, then that wipes out all the last of the laborers around, but I'm not getting any building done. Um, and that's kind of important now. We're into the middle of June. We've given them four weeks off. I need to thin out labor in some places so I can get other things going. I think that's really we still have too few people. So we're still doing a balancing game. So, can I sell charcoal to Durakachi? I guess that's what's going through my mind right now. And I'm starting to think I cannot. If we only have 2,900 there, the town in, in as, as a whole has none. So, we have once again <laughs> stolen charcoal from everybody. You have none. And you have none. Okay. Yeah, that's going to be a harsh balance for a while, isn't it? Um, but I need to know that you are going to get to complete your sale. So let's just see this happen. Is anybody... Yeah, you are going to do what? And or... Who are you? Trading post. Why didn't you pop in as one of the guys? I don't know. That's weird. You say you work at the trading post. Yet when I pass over these guys that should land 
just like him on each one of them but none of them lands on you what's your name your name is Petro we've got Pablo you're not a laborer hey, our labor buttons back so how are you listed as trading post taking you rest Oh, the manager. There you are. Okay, mystery solved. Now, what are you doing? You are going to be loaded up with charcoal. Are we done with that? Pop into here, world map. You are exporting charcoal. There's one more coming in. And there's one more coming in. Dang. So, we don't have enough for us or the rest of the town. We're at 700. I'm going to have to cancel the rest of that, unfortunately. We've got to have charcoal back. You guys need to go pick it up. There's a thousand being reserved by somebody to go fill up a trader. Yeah, we've got to get that going again. All right, so we're we're done with selling charcoal for a while. Um, next shot in the arm is going to be a bunch of oil. Now, we did have a bunch of oil sitting up here. And who's selling oil? Uh, we've got 20 in the market over there. That's the only place there. I probably need to get oil in the market down here, though I don't know if you'd be able to go and get it that far away. Let's put oil in here. Um, sunflower oil, not oil. All right, you're going to be in there. And what else could go down here that's, that's obvious that we could start selling to these folks? Firewood is down here. Don't have any fish? Don't think so. So I could do that just to get us by. Instead of fish, we'll put sunflower oil. Okay, that way it's still just one worker down here. Okay, so you are none. That takes care of that. You could then go and get some sunflower oil. So they don't have a distance problem there. So, path, you're no, you're going to get something else. Do you sell salt? No. Firewood. Potatoes. Why are you going to the... I didn't think they could take it from here. There's 300 oil here. But... Hmm. I don't know. You are headed for here. Speed you up. Let's see what you're going to get. I didn't think you would take it from here unless it was... Yeah, it was 100 oil. I have 200 oil. I... I... I deleted the oil. When did I delete the oil? I don't know. Sunflower oil. I, I must have deleted the oil. All right, we're, we're keeping the other 200. Thank you. All right. So in that case, that we could sell because as I was trying to get out, we've got 600 and some, 500 and some sitting here. Did you restock? You did, 110. So the rest could head down into here, at least quite a bit of it. Let's grab oil. Uh, let's make that 300. And we will have that for sale almost immediately, right? Am I running? Why is spacebar not working? I gotta get over here. There we go. So you... 300. Is anybody on their way to go get sunflower oil? You are doing that. No, no. You you tried to fake me out there. You're going to grab more clothing. Okay. Oh, we got two ladies working in there now. Good. That's gonna help out a lot. Someone's hauling a textile. Somebody's making clothing. Good, that helps. Um, no exports available for, I didn't get to read that. You here? Charcoal. So we have run out of charcoal. And I assume you left? Well, if you did, you did in a hurry. I don't see you at all. <laughs> or you just canceled them completely and they didn't even make it in. That's them. Okay. So we're done with that trade. We are out of charcoal except for what we put back into the town you got some of it and you got some of it okay we need to make more 
and that's where I get back to what I was starting to say a little while ago. I need to sit down and really think about reallocating labor and getting things moving around. You guys are still employed. You guys are fully employed. We have lots of trees to take down on all those other projects. And there's still somebody else trying to get charcoal from us. Yeah, I guess I really oversold the charcoal. But I thought at that point that I read something like, come on, let go, I guess that there was exported it was this one and charcoal was listed and it was like 22,000 or something sitting there I'd have to go back and look at that episode again did I really miss that? I don't know I thought we had a lot that, that, that represented all that was sitting in these uh, completed a well okay good got that one going that was messing me up trying to lay out this house, trying to figure out where the entrance was. Though I think in the end I ended up putting the entrance somewhere else. Yeah, I put it out here on the street instead. Okay. Boy, it's hard to hit right click. Every time I do, the map moves a pixel and then it won't shut down. Um, so you are that one. I think it's one of those episodes I'm, it's not going to feel like I've got much done, but I had a lot of fun doing it. <laughs> Somebody was out of water, but I think they went to this well and said, Hey, the well's dry. Yeah, that'll be fixed in a little while as soon as it pulls back up again. How are we looking in here now? Oh, that's right. I mentioned last time that fence went away, and they're, they're cutting through. Look at that, cutting right through my fences. Yeah. Connect you. Boy, it's hard to see you. It is hard to see you. Let's turn that off. Uh, this one? and always show. There is a fence right there. I wanted you to come over here and just kind of block them from walking through there so this can all be grass. I think it would look a lot better. Um, Alright, so what other things have I started to talk about and didn't finish? We got you reset to 30 to 30. So now there's 20 hatchlings currently and those 20... 15 of them are going to come over here as they grow up. Six now are going to be beyond the 30 when they grow up, and they're going to become um, raw meat, chicken meat. And we're no longer saving any eggs to make hatchlings. Oh, yes, we are. So until we have 30 hatchlings, we're saving our eggs. And then we'll start selling eggs again in the market. So how many eggs are actually in the market right now? You have eggs, but none. So no eggs, no chicken meat. Okay, and I'm no longer selling eggs down here. That was fixed. Yeah. All right, so what's happening in here now? Um, you have 680, and there's honey that is leaving. You, uh, where am I? Have only the 200, and you stopped. Okay, if I click that again you will immediately go and start to pick that up. So only the one that says take from other granaries can take from other granaries. Granaries. Okay. So, and I can't get you. Are you working? You are. If I... Though it's probably a bad example. If, if there were only three things here and I put peas back in there, well, no, because you'll come over here and get peas. Yeah, I think I need to hire another person. Who's only going to... No, there is nobody. There's only three houses down here. Yeah. All right. Scratch all of that. You guys are no workers for harvest. So you're saying there really is a harvest going on right now. And we are into July. Okay. So June was not necessary. So apply that to all. And I need some workers. And I do want that harvest. So let's carefully work through the system here and think about this. How can I get some ladies to work down there? Um, I would imagine we're doing great right here. We're great, great enough for a while. We'll turn you off temporarily. There are no ladies working in here. There are ladies working in all of the warehouses. Thatch, firewood, nails. What do we know about how the warehouses work? Do they have to be employed to get things back out? Or is that just to bring things in? 
Serves as a storage place for non-food items. Um, add a resource. Use the text box to choose how much to store. Uh, when there's too much, the number will turn red. Useful when you need resources stored closer to where they are required. Does not handle clay, sand, water, etc. Um, and you can stock the slots automatically. So it doesn't tell me that answer. Okay. If I were to turn off all of the warehouses for a while. So how would I do that without having to wander the whole place? I could... We're not doing seasonal hiring. So I guess I'll just do it manually. You're not there anymore. You're not there anymore. You're not there anymore. There's four women available. What jobs are calling for them? One more over here. Do we have work for them? There's no textile in here. There's no textile in here. So we're not making the textile fast enough to justify two people over here. Yeah, or especially three. Could do that and get a shot in the arm of textile with one of those jobs. Um, you, we are employed. How much leather's floating around? No leather there. We're basically out of leather here. And I doubt there's any leather stored anywhere else. So we're about the end of our leather supply. Yeah. So definitely don't need two of you taking a rest. You can finish off the last... Although we're only calling for 500. Hmm. Let's shut that industry down for right now. Okay, so that's five jobs available. I've already done that one. So five women are suddenly available. Which after a week's rest... Oh, we can see the fruit. These are apricots? Yeah. And these would be apples. Okay. And nothing here. So these did not bloom or blossom. Okay. So we should see these fill in here real soon. As soon as a few, few days go by over there. Okay. Um, Dracachi's gone. I didn't get any of those sales done. We're at 710. Remember 710. Okay, you filled. You were the closer job, so you filled first. You should be next and soon. I fired quite a few all at the same time, so really just a matter of how much longer it took someone else to walk all the way home to start your timer. But surely somebody will pop in here real quick. Then all the rest of them should jump into um, any laborer jobs temporarily till I rehire everyone. There shouldn't be any laborer jobs around here. No, this shouldn't have any jobs at all right now. Okay, you are fine. 149 and 102. There's some sunflower in there. Can I... I Actually, I did call for linseed at one time. Yeah, so just none, none in, the, in the town. We've got a harvest coming up next month. There should be a, at least more wheat for the chickens and more sunflower for the chickens. A lot of that coming. And the potato. What are you? You are hemp. Okay, so more, more uh, a reason to get the the textile markets going again. Okay. All right. So with that, we are harvesting. What does that mean? 150, 11 at a time. Is there enough to get this done? Do we get any sense? We do. And if they're only gonna do it in July, then I'm guessing we need to double this up. Why did you both do that? Did I not click? I didn't click. Okay. I thought I did. So let's get two people in there while we have the two people available. And make sure we get as much out of this as we can. Then we get apples. Now if I don't call for apples up here, that's interesting. What happens there? Let's call for apples again. Were you in this one? I was going to say don't call for apples so that they can make dried fruit, but that doesn't really... Oh, from the town. Apples would be over here. Apples, apricots, and eventually cherries should all land in here. Okay, and we're not going to buy them from locals, so they'll make dried fruit out of them. Let me know if my reasoning is wrong. 
but it would be nice if you guys would come and steal a bunch of those too. Grab some apples, grab some apricots um, right there, and grab some cherries. Not taking them from the town. Oh, that's right. How many? Um, 200. Try that again. kind of wish that there was a default number that would automatically populate this. If, you, if you're going to go to the trouble to click on apples, obviously you want some apples. So it should be, you know, default 100 just to get the system working for when you, you forget to do a simple little step like that. Uh, 500 up here. There's more people to buy them. And in case it over loads down there. I don't know how many are actually going to come out of this thing. So, so far we're at 300 and two. Okay, any more workers? You've got your second worker now. You should get yours next. Did any of them get around to hauling firewood? We got some going there. So those you did not. I wonder if the game lists these things in an order of some kind. Or is it just by distance? This charcoal pile will always be done first that one always lasts sort of a thing okay so trees that are being stripped we are well we only started about here so we've run I think we're gonna be close you're mostly done actually you are okay so let's remember to fire these two ladies as the last of these get done and they can jump down into Oh, we didn't get any help here. Okay. So, we will min-max this one. You're done. There's no more in happening. You are working, but nothing's happening, right? You are taking a rest. Okay, so you two are done. Maybe somebody will jump into here. Okay, there's one. You are going to work. So, yeah, I think they're going to get it done in time. So, we managed to get... Well, 350 are sitting there. Did you... Apples. That's the top one? Yeah, so 350, 450, 530. Did you grab some? 630. So we got quite a bit out of there. Okay. And they're going to both be coming at it equally. So that it isn't this place trying to get it back from this place sort of a thing so by you know the harvest hitting and they both go after it they'll both get some and some of these market stalls are going to get some which means i need to hire another lady we don't have apples in any of these do we we've never really had them available to us yeah populate right there let's do it let's sell them no point in letting them sit there and rot. Now, if they buy apples and apricots, will they make dried fruit at home? Okay. I'm trying to think a few steps ahead of myself. Anyway, you are off to go get some more. You are. Yum, yum. And I'm going to fill all these in. Great. So that's happening. Uh, one tree left. We, we did it. And it's done. Okay, so you and you... And you are buying food. Okay, you're done, and you're done. We're done for the year. Okay, so that helps me understand how this works. You will be two people. Well, I can't really set that right now. Wait till August hits. Two people in the month of July only. Four people back in here building houses. Still have five in there. Still have three in here. What are you guys doing, though? Well, you're supplying jobs for the three guys down here is what you're doing. But we, we're not going to be concentrating on these trees anymore. So that tells me it's probably time to swap this all out while there's still a little bit of time left. Do that. Do that. Get some fish in while it's still possible. Because they're not really helping out in any of the 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 jobs over here to clear trees and I don't really need these trees cleared anymore 
Yeah. In fact, let's cancel that one. And we'll cancel all these so that it's no longer an influence on how things work. In case these guys, for some reason, right here, get the get a, the command to go and clear these trees out for some strange reason under the hood. All right. So, where am I? 45 minutes. What more can I do to feel like I've accomplished something? Um, I want to get into October. I want to see what happens when all of these things start to sell. Hmm. So, we have up here honey and peas. And that's it. Honey and peas. And then we have salt. Apples. Flour. So we are we have a water problem here. Um, okay, there's that. And salt. Get salt for these folks. That justifies two jobs down here. I don't know that anybody will fill the job, but it's worth at least attempting. Yeah, it would be nice to get the three houses over here done. So what is next? primary school is next and our workers our builders have not actually been employed throughout this so that should be their next job where did that go right over there they are employed they brought almost all the required child is born almost all the required uh, materials so they should fly through this pretty quick and get that built um, I don't see the materials oh they're all out over here finally they didn't drop it inside of their building site <laughs> always drives me nuts when they when they have to oh we've got the harvest happening when they have to push through the uh, um, yeah harvest happening through their building materials to continue building what is their building um, I gotta fire everybody again don't I I do we need to harvest and we have nobody Okay, yeah, it may be a couple of episodes, uh, frustrating episodes of... Mm, there. Of shifting labor around to make all of these things happen. Did you hire? You did. Where do you live? You live all the way over there and yet you were willing to do this. Now, how come I couldn't get you guys to take any jobs over here? Huh. I don't know. Okay. But that is functioning. So you brought all these in to your limit. You haven't brought anything in, but we're going to be able to buy from people here in another month. Okay. So you are the last one to come to be taken down there's not much there we didn't we got laid on this one may i think so we're gonna get some out of it not gonna get a lot get a lot more out of this one sunflowers than that whole one over there but with all of the potential yeah we're starting to fill in now we'll get all this harvested we'll be able to process it next episode and make something of it and hopefully have something to sell the uh, the, the next merchant that comes through and hopefully through the winter get around to working on some of these properties you have got no trees left so you're going to be able to start working soon no trees left there so the five have been doing a pretty good job of, of clearing out the beginning projects here it's only this one left that has two trees left that's all the houses i set up to be worked on so if i could just keep the builders employed maybe we shut something else down shut this down for a while and get eight workers going and just plow through some houses. Maybe we'll just keep jog, you know, jogging back and forth. Marifa, Marifa, you never want to buy our stuff. Do we have anything new? You want sunflowers, lime, dried fish, sunflower oil? We do have now 300 in the export stock. There's 350. So let's sell the 300. And that doesn't bankrupt us. We stood four in there so we're making it again right well, why did that go up deal I didn't re-employ I, I re-employed that oh it automatically employed 
with the with August with the harvest coming in. Okay, so one worker there, and just keep you going. Perfect. Okay, so there's a little bit being sold to them. We're at six six seven instead of seven ten, so we are gradually losing still. We're not balanced yet, and we haven't hit October, which this should lose quite a bit. Okay, um, you also. What have I got? Eleven more days. Buckwheat flour. Flour's a good thing. Let's do the 500. Let's do 400. Uh, no, let's do 500. We're not going to bankrupt the town because they are able to grab in between some of the... Uh, yeah, we're fine there. Deal. Um, chicken eggs, no. Horseshoes, salt, iron, metal parts, flax. So that's all they're willing to buy. Anything that we need from them. More hemp would get more cloth going. More warm clothes. Let's go ahead and do our, our 100 every time these guys come by. Deal. And we'll just keep gradually putting warm clothes back into the system here and there. Um, seven days left, warm clothes. Do I want wheat and hemp? Raw materials to make more textiles and clothes and to make more flour. Buying hemp at 0.08, selling clothes. Uh, I don't have a choice here to see it. I think so. Let's... That's 84 for that. Let's do 500. Hemp coming in. And wheat, 500. Those are raw materials for us to make more stuff from. So we have leaving 80. 130. Coming in, yeah, about the same 130. That was a balanced trade. Okay. For Marefa, that's pretty good. <laughs> so we are doing what? We're into September. Does the harvest, does the crop degrade as it waits and waits and waits? Wow, what happened there? That was full a second ago. Did the map just update itself? I thought for sure I looked up there and unless I saw this, I thought I saw a full dark one there. Fascinating. And that's interesting. They're cutting off the heads leaving the rest of the plant. Huh. That's what it would look like in reality, too. Leave all the stubs behind. Ah, interesting. Whereas here, it strips your back all the way down. That's potatoes. And, yeah, the, so these, apparently, they're, they're cutting off at ground level. Okay. Have we got... Oh, we're just starting to get somebody down here. Okay. So all of that is coming down. We're into September now. Let's try and push this into October and watch what happens as the town harvests all of its goods and sells it to us. Can these guys attract any of those purchases and have them just be sold to the town? That would be an interesting thing to find out. There's going to be more peas to sell, though maybe we don't really want to buy them anyway. Well, okay, we could fill this one up over here. We can't sell them, but they don't go bad. Oh, that's right, that's right. I was watching Skibbeth today, and he's got this guy going. And some of these guys here or here will buy some of the garden foods. So it's not a loss to do something like that. So maybe I want to push this up a little bit higher... We'll do something like, oh, actually, I can do now the 1250 here. Yeah, these guys will take from that, but only up until 500. That must be how we're going to regulate this. That must be how we're going to do it. Okay. Wait for an October to finish, see what these guys actually have in stock, and then grab the half of that number and put that in over here. They'll go and steal it, and then both will have about the same amount. Something like that. Until they sell it, then they go steal more, and they sell it, and they go steal more. So I guess I have to have a number that is smaller than these guys. Yeah. But that will happen here in another week. So what's happening otherwise? How Are we done? We're not. We're still trying to get this one done. Be nice to be able to. And we do have lots of workers who are where at the moment? 
you are leaving, you're working, you are getting there, and you are on your way too. And you just popped in, you're on your way. So another week or so, get this one done, then I'll reset all the jobs probably after the episode and get everything even out again to go through the winter. And we'll eventually get to a point, there's pieces coming and going, okay? We'll eventually get to a point when we have enough housing, new housing there, new housing here, to where I won't have to play this balancing game anymore. And there will be enough people to do all the different jobs. That's mostly my fault, because really what I wanted to do was... Got a worker coming. Uh, resources, getting a drink of water, taking a rest, taking a rest. This one may fail. You have warm clothes. Dudes, we need a warm clothes. So you are... When you get back, you're going to take a rest. I need a rest to be done. Here you are. We got someone who was working at the... at here. So what happened here? Three guys jumped into here. You're up in there. Okay. Anyway, you got a warm clothes, and you're loading up. You're getting the hemp. And you brought our wheat. And then we should be... other folks will be grabbing the hemp to... well, I gotta re-employ them. Then, then she will grab the hemp. Yeah. So, in fact, I could probably just kind of... Well, not yet. Let's get the last little bit of here done. She may have, been, may have been one of the workers that was working here. We want to get this done, get what we can out of here. It doesn't really tell me what our, our harvest was. Do we get that information from up here? We know total there were about 1,000 and 50 has been... Shocked? What do you do to sunflowers? The, the heads. It's, it's kind of, I guess you can say threshed or whatever. Yeah. But no sense of what the individual field did. Uh, go to field, but no accounting. Click on it. Nothing. Okay. Uh, oh. No, it's a... S 1729 for there. Five is this one. And 1726. Can't change the crop. This one. Okay. So this one, being so far away, I'm doing it so late in the season, though being three times as big, made the same amount as this one field over here well positioned and and planted immediately that's actually a pretty good lesson i'm glad i noticed that so to have a whole bunch of great big fields and not enough people to do them so that some of them don't get done until all the way into may planted you're not gaining any more than having medium sized fields that get done really well and free up your labor that much sooner to get back and do other jobs. Okay, so one last little argument toward not going overboard at first. I can see that we definitely need bigger fields for the productions that I want to do, but we don't have the labor to really supply it. So I was thinking this winter I would combine these two into bigger ones, but I think I'm going to wait another year before we do that. This is an experiment. I'm glad I did it. So you're done. Okay, and we're into October. So let's see what's happening over here. Slow you back down. You are... These bars are full, so these have been sold to us. So things are coming in. 102 marrow are on their way in. Um, up arrow there, 247 onions are on their way in. Is anything on its way into here? We got 20... He's coming because she went to go get it. <laughs> Otherwise, nobody is selling to us down here. There's you know, a slot for Meryl, but nobody's making the run. They're going to the nearest one. So if the nearest one didn't have room for it all. So maybe that's where I've got... Well, we'll let it all come in. And then we'll do that. I'll do that experiment. I'll see what the total is. I'll do maybe a third of that over here. 
and then have these steal from there. Maybe that's how we're going to make this work. And then when there's a neighborhood later over here, we will equally have them steal from there one third, one third of the whole, and maybe find some way to balance things out that way. Okay. Well, I think I've rambled on enough here. Not much more I can accomplish at this point. I have some balancing to do in between episodes. And then I need to get all the constructors going again. And maybe next episode we'll start plowing through a bunch of these neighborhoods. And getting uh, getting these going as well as... Lost ya. These three over here going. And that will bring in more workers and keep things functioning. So with that, going to call it done here. Thanks for watching, folks. And I'll catch you later. Bye-bye now.